Welcome to my channel. My name is Salentia and I'm your mom who's trying to get her family to financial freedom. I work two part-time jobs. One of my jobs is um, weekly pay and the other one is twice a month. But what I've been trying to do is actually stuff my envelopes weekly. I've been trying to work more hours um, to get a little bit more money. Um, so I will give you uh, a quick little rundown of what happened last week. Um, I actually was sick um, the week before. So last week when I got paid to actually cash stuff for this week, I um, had a really, really small paycheck. <laughs> so I'm just going to have to make do with that. However, I also received a huge blessing. Uh, so I want to give a special thank you uh, to Mia. She's here on YouTube and Instagram. Um, her channel name is Mia's Envelopes, and I'll link her down below. Um, she actually sent me money to my cash app, um, you know, to try to keep me a little bit encouraged. It, you know, she knows my struggle. Um, and I, I think that um, it's never expected for somebody to lend a helping hand. It's never expected. But I'm telling you, it came right on time. I'm so grateful. Um, what I decided to do with that money that she gave to me, which I'll tell you, the amount was 80 bucks, uh, which is huge for a person who is struggling the way that I am right now. Um, I'm buying my kids shoes with that money. So thank you, Mia. <laughs> thank you so much. I truly appreciate your blessing. So yeah, you never know what people are really going through and um, if you can sense that they do need help and uh, maybe you feel like giving, do so because it, it created um, some room in, in my life to do something for my kids that I know I need to do, but with our finances being the way they are right now, I've been struggling. <laughs> so thank you. Um, so this week, I don't even know what I have. I will be so very honest with you. I did go to the grocery store and I picked up a few things, um, just because we, we needed them last week when I did my cash stuffing, I was shopping for my pantry, which worked out really well. I actually pulled some, um, items from my pantry, um, just to see what I have and maybe look over what I can work with, um, for the next week. And you guys, I'm really hoping that I get myself back on track here because this um, uncertainty is, it's stressing my brain. <laughs> and I, I, I think that people in general understand that, especially when it comes to money, people get that. And, and I think it's so relatable. And um, that's the reason why I still feel like, okay, well, I don't have much to stuff, but it's a way for me to connect with other people, which obviously that's the main reason I'm on here is because I don't want to feel like I'm in the world alone. But also, um, a lot of people gave some really good suggestions um, in the last couple of videos, which I was just like, thank you. That's awesome. And then also, people were just like, don't give up because sometimes you just need to know um, that you have some cheerleaders, complete strangers sometimes that are saying, look, you got this. There's, you know, nothing to fret about. And I, I believe that, you know, we all go through, we got to go through. I said all of that to say, whatever you're going through, whether it's a, a good season in your life, you know, be grateful, whether it's a hard season in your life, be grateful and know that I am cheering you on just as you guys have been doing for me. So anyway, before I get all emotional and stuff, <laughs> let's count up what we have because I know it. this stuffing may be a little bit um, more all over the place than usual because I don't have what I normally would stuff. So I have 20, 40, 50, I thought I saw two tens. Did I not? I'm going crazy. Hmm. Oh, there it is. 20, 40, <laughs> 50, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 
96, 97, 98, 99, 100, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 105 dollars. Okay, so that's not horrible, right? That's that's a good amount of money to work it out through the week. I just need to shop my pantry again, which I completely intended on doing. So let's start with groceries because I know I don't have anything left over. Um, let's start with groceries because I think we'll give that one $50. Let's see. So we have 20 40 50 Okay, so that that's our main um, priority is making sure we can eat. <laughs> um, I do have like in a little emergency stash of toiletries and stuff like that. So um, if I need to, if I absolutely have to use it, I will. But let's see what we can do here. We'll come back to mine last. Uh, we'll go ahead and do $20 for gas. I definitely need gas. 10 15 20 Okay, so gas and groceries. Let's see what we can do with the rest of this here. Um, let's see. Let's do five dollars for household. Let's see what we can do with that. And then pets. I normally do ten dollars. Let me see if I can get away with seven dollars for him, for my kitty, because my fish is he's. It's, he's easy because I buy uh, food and uh, filters one time a year for him. So um, we'll do $7 for our kitty and see how that works out. We've been feeding him less um, just because he's he's a, he's a chubby kitty, but also he's been struggling with um, if we leave the food down, he'll just keep eating. Um, so we want to make sure that we're trying to... Um, watch him and make sure he's not eating all day and you know having issues with his stomach um let's see so my boys let's i don't know yet so let's do um for laundry let's do seven dollars as well so five six seven for laundry and what i think i'm going to do is go um to the laundromat on one of the days where they have a deal. Uh, I said I was going to check on it last week and I didn't, but I'm going to check on it today. <laughs> so I know which day to actually go to the laundromat because they have like dollar days. So instead of spending a full $10, I may only need like four or five. Um, so yeah, let's see. we got a couple dollars here. Um, let's see. We have one, two, three, four, five, six. So what I'll do is I will have $3 for Vincent, $3 for Victor, and um, they can earn this money. And uh, matter, as a matter of fact, we, um, we went on an, a little adventure um, yesterday to a place that we used to go all the time. Um, and so I ended up spending all of my spending money from last week taking them there so I don't think they're going to be asking for much um and then I have I have ten dollars left so I will go ahead and put that in my cash envelope so I can have ten dollars in spending um it's gonna have to do <laughs> you know I I think that I always I get so caught up in trying to meet the goals and the numbers I set for myself in my head and I think I need to be real mo more realistic in terms of what I can do instead of you know overextending myself with trying to um, reach those goals so yes I've gone ahead and stuffed my envelopes I did the very best I could and I'm so proud of me and I hope you do the same you know sometimes it's not you know, those um, numbers you think it's going to be. So um, I think that's it. We've stuffed it and we're all good to go. Yes. Anyway, thanks so much for stopping by. I appreciate each and every one of you. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe. All of the things that can keep us connected. And I look forward to seeing you in my next video. Feel free to check out SNC Budget Creations on Etsy. We're also on Instagram. I will link them down below. We have some cash envelopes, sinking fund envelopes. 
We also have savings challenges. So a lot of goodies over there. Some things are printables. Um, I'm going to try to make a uh, code for my YouTube um, <laughs> so you guys can actually get a little discount. Um, I'm going to work on that as soon as I finish here. Uh, so anyway, check out the shop. But that's it, guys. Thanks so much for watching. Have a good day.